learners i hope you have enjoyed the week one of the course in the module one we have discussed about the learning its perspectives and the process of instruction now you must be ready to explore the concept nature and scope of instructional designs which is basically the title of your module 2 in this module we will discuss about various instructional designs concept of instructional design its definitions and a scope nowadays when we talk about instructional designs we also come across a new concept called learning designs so what are learning designs how they are linked or different from the instructional design one section will be on that then we will talk about the need and importance of instructional design for an instructor what common tasks are there for an instructional designer what you need to do if you need to perform a role of an instructional designer and what are various components of instructional design there are basically four common components about which we will not only discuss we will also expect that after completing all these sections of the module in this week you are able to develop at least a blueprint so what are the major objectives of this module after completion of this module you will be able to differentiate between learning design and instructional design you will be able to examine the need of instructional design for open and distance learning and online education and you will be able to develop a blueprint based on four components of instructional design in order to facilitate your learning we will provide you e-text we will provide you youtube videos we will provide you uh, some discussion forum questions we will also interact in face to face mode by using any synchronous tool and we will provide you a learning task which you need to complete which is basically the development of a blueprint at the end of the module you will have a quiz in which you need to answer the questions so friends be ready to become an instructional design and let us explore the module thank you